Yes, ma'am. I don't take it, but I'm not working tomorrow, so it doesn't matter. But it doesn't give me high. It's supposed to be for pain. Like pain. It's what it said it can be used for pain. No. I do have to disagree with you though. The strain that we got is for everything, not just for pain. You know what I'm saying? But it does help with pain. Right? I only took a little itty bitty tiny little thing and it's not even a drug. Are you in pain? A little bit. Yeah, Why? like my bruise still hurts and my my leg hurts. Why does your bull hurt? My bruise hurts. I'm a, my leg, it still hurts. This one, it's been weeks. It still hurts. Yeah, but you said earlier he didn't even beat on you, so how'd you get it? I said I don't think he meant to or like he was like just in a rage. Flexing his bait. I flex baits because I'm homeless. Where's the dog at all this time? She's right there sleeping on my jacket. She's sleeping like a little angel. She is an angel, really. She... I, I showed all the time a picture of my bruise on the fifth day, and that was the fifth day, and this is like the... I don't fucking hit women. That's from her last man. That's, that's from her last man. I'll be damned the day I hit a female. That's from her last man. Yeah. I use the capsule and I would have to take a boat. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Aubrey said she takes the capsules and she would have to take eight to ten caps at a time and I did that about four to five times a day depending on how bad the withdrawals were. Like, you can't speak on what a normal person would do, baby. Well, if you're weaning off that person ate, also, I'm saying if you're weaning off something, like me, I don't want to be a Kratom addict. I don't even want to want it or need it. You don't do any drugs at all. I know that. And so I'm saying, like, for, I, I, for me, if I was weaning off, I would take just the smallest bit just you to take the edge off. I would try and experiment with my body to see what's the smallest little tiny bit that I can take rather than just continuously taking it. Like, like I do experiment just to see what's the smallest I can take where it takes the edge off and I still feel okay, but I don't need more, you know? Yeah. I, like, I don't, I don't, I would never wake up and be like, oh, I want to do it all day, you know? But I, I could see waking up and being like, let me take a little itty, itty tiny little bit and see if it takes any edge off my day, you know? But I wouldn't want to drink that tea or anything all day like that. They said, why does it seem like everything you do bothers her? Like, it doesn't seem like she's trying to help you. Seems like she's just judging you. I got that because you're on withdrawal. Listen, I'm not judging you, but listen, no, I, how do you help an addict? And abusing another thing like Kratom isn't necessarily helping you. The point is to wean off all of that. It's not to be like, take your addictions and then make another giant addiction. It's to like, Kratom is supposed to be used to wean off other drugs. And then you if you're going to fuck with me and you're going to have me in your household, you're going to know I'm going to take drugs and get high almost every fucking day I'm here. Do you understand me, miss? That's really difficult. Like, like I said, I can go to, I can stay with you for another week. We can take it day by day, or I could go to California tomorrow. I'm telling you, the drugs are overpowering everything in my life right now. I'm sorry. Well, I mean, you can stay another week, but if they're overpowering you, then you should like still make sense. To I mean, but am I really high, high on heroin, or am I just on kratom right now? Wait, you told me you were gonna try to get healthy and go to the gym and get a job and try to better your life and all that. How are you going to do that if you want to get high every day? I'll go to work. I probably couldn't go to work unless I was off Kratom. So, why don't you wean yourself off that then? Because who wants to live in this earth sober? I do. I go to the gym. I'm sober. Like, and I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not a sober person. I never will be. If it's not Kratom, it's weed. If it's not weed, it's Percocet. If it's not Percocet, it's Zan. If it's not Zan, it's beans. If it's not beans, it's fucking meth. You don't think that's super sad? Not really. I have a very, I'm from the transfer. I sold drugs in my mind now. So you don't want to better for your life? 
That is better for my life to me. Not really. Think about if you, you were in the future, you ever had children and your children My children are not going to be around. They're not going to know what drugs are. It's the difference. I'm sure that they would see you that way. You would want your kids to see you that way? 